Uh, today we're showcasing the new 380 HLDC, which is the new airborne ISR and targeting system we have, uh, developed off a previous version of the 380 HD that was designed for rotary platforms by making it shorter and lighter weight, and we've unveiled that last year, and then this year at AUSA, we're showcasing the targeting model of that product, now featuring a combat-proven laser designator and in-flight boresight module. So this product features full high-definition imaging out of four different imaging sensors at the same time and combat-proven laser designation. So what sets this product apart is first off what we call the swap T advantage, size, weight, and power, plus true targeting capabilities. So usually in this space, customers are faced with the challenge of, of, uh, of very long-range performance or compact form factor. And often what gets sacrificed is targeting capabilities of the power of the laser. What FLIR specializes in is packaging the most capable sensors in the smallest payload. And so what we're able to finally bring to the rotary community is a product that gives them that long range standoff capability and full range precision laser designation capability. I think any worldwide customer who's operating a light attack or rotary platform will make uh, will see the value of this product because of its reduced height profile and reduced weight while still offering very long range multispectral HD imaging. Well, one of the other things we're very excited to showcase here at AUSA is the LTVX, which is a fully integrated mobile surveillance capability built on an M-Razor platform and incorporating multi-spectral high-definition imaging systems, ground surveillance radar, and an integrated command and control system, which also allows the operator to operate and stream video from micro UAS, such as the Prox Dynamics Black Hornet.